An emotional day in Bridgeport where friends and family gathered to remember all of those lost to violence over the past year. News South Connecticut's Frank Recchia has the story. One family member was really struggling with depression. 65-year-old Cass Shaw of Bridgeport says the driving force behind her mission to help steer kids away from guns with every avenue at our disposal is a deeply held personal belief that growing up in a safe place should not be a privilege reserved for the rich. That's why she's pulling up at McCleavy Green. The 20 to 30 gunshots fired that night were believed to have been intended for a prior resident to take part in an annual vigil, one sponsored by the Council of Churches of Greater Bridgeport. Let's stop fighting. Let's stop gun violence. Every year, those who come to remember pay special tribute through word, prayer, and moments of silence to every name on their list. In 2021, there were 22 victims. There are kids in Bridgeport who don't think they're going to live past 25, and we have the power to stop that. Sean Reeves lost his 16-year-old son and says one way to find a path forward is by coming together to help build awareness. Me personally, uh, it put me on this path. So now, you know, my aim is to end gun violence um, and everything that poverty's created in communities like mine. It is so important to, you know, to hold these lives up. Some of them are 16 years old. Sean had lost a 16 year old. They say gun violence is a tall obstacle, casting a dark shadow over the entire country. The problem that we have is that it's just too easy to get a gun. In Bridgeport, Frank Recchia, News 12, Connecticut.